My name is Derek Massey. I'm a rising senior and I attend Lowell High School in Lowell, Michigan. I was prompted in applying to this because I talked to one of the admissions counselor and kind of asked him what he thought about it. And he said, you know, Derek, I think this would be a good fit. You should probably apply. So I applied and here I am. So. I love my instructors. The faculty is amazing. They're all like, hey, just call me by your first name. They're like, are you sure? Like, it's normally miss or missus or doctor. And they're like, no, I'm sure. Just call me Don or something. I'm like, okay, Don. So it, they're really, they're all really passionate about what they do. And I think that kind of translates to the students because they're all, they're all passionate about what they do. And we're passionate about science. And it's kind of like, kind of like a motive to continue on with our learning during our classes. The advice that I would give to potential students applying to this program, diversify your application. Kind of like broaden your horizons. Don't just stick with sports or just strictly academic groups. Like you kind of want to broaden your horizons and expand upon yourself because that's what Notre Dame exemplifies. Notre Dame exemplifies a university of wholehearted people and I think that's, that's what they're looking for for applicants. I think the most significant thing was probably Shakespeare behind bars. I think it was a, everybody overlooks a lot of things in life and that's also what we try to go over in science ethics and responsibilities is the ethical side and I think in many instances everybody overlooks inmates and thinks that they're all bad people they're all uneducated people and that's not true like that's just that's uh, it's a rather I don't know like misconstrued topic is like inmates like nobody really knows what they go through nobody knows their side of the story and I think that that was something that we all realized coming here and it was just it applies to a lot of facets of life.